<laughs> freaky, right? Well, today we're going to be playing a freaky game. It's called Detention. Detention is an atmospheric horror game set in the 1960s Taiwan under martial law. Ooh. Incorporated religious elements based on Taiwanese and Chinese. Chinese? What am I doing? Chinese culture and mythology. Now, I'm a really big fan of mythology. Love it. Mainly Greek mythology. But, whatever. Let's go ahead and get this show on the road. Woo! I went ahead and fixed my cam, you know, uh, I thought it was like low quality when I did the intro just now, and I was like, dang, I need to make sure that I can see the face, the goods, you know? I think this is like more pleasing to the eye, you know, for the viewer, you, at home. So let's just go ahead and jump into it, and it says continue because I started it, and uh, you know, I just, it was shitty quality, so I was wanting to fix it real quick, so I exited it out, and whatever, doesn't matter. Class, the following material is important. Pay attention. This will be on the next exam. During this time period, many provincial military leaders... I don't know if I pronounced that provincial. I don't know. The next president then started the northern expedition still occurring... Oh, I can't fucking read. Look, it's Instructor Bay! This guy's coming with some bad news. Look at how you can tell. Miss Yen, may I have a moment of your time? Okay, class, let's take a short break. Better? What's going on, dude? Miss Yen. Have you seen this list before? What the fuck? What is going on? I guess we was nodding out, uh, and then we fell asleep. Um, did I fall asleep? This is strange. Where is everybody? How come nobody's here? A typhoon alert! <laughs> there shouldn't be any typhoons this time of year. Oh, it's weird. What's going on here? All right, let's see. We got an eye clicking thing. The sound of howling wind. Typhoon must be getting close. Oh, damn, bro. What should we do? I should hurry home. There's a note on this table. Where did Miss Yen go? Whoever was passing this note in class was worried about Mrs. Yen. Miss Yen keeps calling in sick lately. That's weird. No kidding, man. I hate those other subs they send in. Shit. School anthem. Our school anthem, it actually has a decent melody. The lyrics, however, feel like another one of those propaganda promoting patriotism. Patriotism. Ugh. School motto and rules. Is it whoa? Is it moto or motto? My motto. Motto. Tomato, tomato, motto, tomato. I don't know. We're going to go with motto. School motto and rules. The first thing in orientation was to memorize the school motto and rules. All that, be honest. All that, be honest. Be brave. Be loyal. Be frugal stuffs. Be frugal stuffs. What are you talking about? And making sure you know it was Principal Mr. Sheen who established these foundations for us. All right, dude. I fucking realize that now. Thank you. I'll put it in my notebook. Yes, you will. Let's go. I should head home. Yes, you should, dude. I need a better voice for him, don't I? It's getting dark out. I should head home. No, I don't know. We'll figure it out. It'll probably, like, differentiate throughout the video, but we'll finally stick with one. <laughs> Look at him run. No way. This is our class schedule. Did I sleep through all the afternoon classes? Oh, we're back in our room, but we got something. Typhoon alert. I thought the weather was quite nice during history class. Is this like one of those... He fell asleep, and we're dreaming right now. Is that what's going on? Kind of like life is strange. The front gate isn't this way. Okay. The 
door is locked. Hmm. It's awfully quiet in this classroom. Have they all gone home? All right, you've said that already. Oh, what's this? Sketch of the old banyan tree. An old sketch of what looks like the banyan tree in the school. There seems to be a figure underneath. That's Instructor Bay. This door is locked. The front gate isn't this way. All right, dude. I hope it's this way, and it is. Bam! There we go. The sign of our principal's office. The principal's office is also locked. Ah! A pot for growing daffodils. Only one of them still hanging in there. What a soldier. What a trooper. There's something in the dirt. Dig it out. An old photograph. Can't tell who's in the picture. There is a quote written on it. The roots below the earth claim no rewards for making branches fruitful. I feel like that's something you would find in a fortune cookie. You know? Who is this mysterious figure over here? Hmm. And who would bury it in the dirt? I don't know. We're going to get to the bottom of it, though. I promise you that. <laughs> Shoot, they closed the roll-up door. That's the only route to the front gate. I've got to figure out a way to open it. <laughs> gotcha, new keys. I think this is the control panel for the roll-up door. Okay, open it. Yeah. It's a mechanical winch. There are instructions on the cover. I think I need a hand crank. Well, goddamn, dude. What are we going to do about that? Aha! There we go. I'm pretty sure this is our hand crank. Good job, dude. Did I just tell myself good job? I'm the worst YouTuber ever. <laughs> Why would someone put this on the wall? I'm not familiar with Buddhist teachings. Me neither, dude. Don't worry about it. We've got our whole lives ahead of us. This is one dirty raincoat. That musty smell is horrifying. Yuck, I would never wear this. I've got a good feeling you're going to end up wearing it. <laughs> Buckle up, kiddo. A kerosene heater. We used it last winter, huddling around it and having a good time. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> having a good time around the whole kerosene heater. Woo! What am I doing? Wait, why is the doors? Oh, because it's that way. Duh. So the lighting. The lighting. You can't see my hands, me. The lighting is in front of us. Alright, let's go ahead and give us baby a try. It's a mechanical winch. There are instructions. So what, what are you talking about? Ah. Ha-ha. I don't know, I feel like this is too small now, you know what I mean? In the comments, someone let me know if this is just like too small. If I should go back to like a normal wider uh, cam. It would be much appreciated, it really would. I just love how he runs, dude. I don't know if he's running, but he's definitely not walking. Uh, that's not how normal people walk, I do know that. The shortest route back home is through this auditorium. Enter. Yeah. Duh. Duh. Miss Yin. Found her. Uh, I guess it's like a little cinematic, so. Yo, what's up, Miss Yen? You just wanted to get me out alone, wasn't you?
Uh, who's this girl? Is she sleeping? Uh, it's not Miss Yen. Hello? She's not responding. Maybe I should get on the stage. What happened? Did she overdose? She's a heroin addict, ain't she? Let's go wake this bitch up. Hello? Wake up! You shouldn't be here. <laughs> um... Where am I? The auditorium! You were sleeping on the stage! Huh? School is cancelled because of a typhoon is coming! Typhoon! Typhoon! Ugh, I just came from my classroom. You're the first person I came across. So I thought he was going to be like getting kind of aggravated at her for being a retard. I am so sorry. Weird. How did I... We should, we should get going. It's getting dark in here. <laughs> the rain is starting to pour. Wait. My necklace is gone. That was horrible. I'm so sorry. My necklace is gone. What? Have you seen my necklace? I don't think so. How? I must have lost it somewhere. I'm not leaving without it. Stubborn, are we? Bitch. Do you need help finding it? Shit, why did we click on her? Why? I didn't want to help her. Would it be too much trouble? Not for a blowjob. <laughs> what? Well, we'll certainly find it faster if we look together. Oh my god, no way I can do it this close. We're gonna have to fix this. That is way better. Thank you then. What kind of necklace are you looking for? A deer shaped jade pendant tied to a black cord. Cheap. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't know. I don't know nothing about jewelry. Let's split up and search for it then. Thanks, it means a lot. You better give me a blowjob after this too. Why were you sleeping in the auditorium? Well, I don't know either. I'm still feeling a little dizzy. Let's find a necklace and go home. Okay. Dumb um, bitch. Uh. Fuck. <laughs> Where is it? How did... The air is humid. It'll be dark soon if we don't get going. I know! That's what I've been saying! Oh, what's this? Something's in here. But I can't reach it. Huh. Okay. Flagpoles and class signs. This stuff is used during our school assemblies. There's an umbrella in this bucket. Take the umbrella? Yeah. Duh! Maybe we can... There's nothing... Alright, maybe we can use the umbrella to get this. There we go! It doesn't look like a deer. Oh, now it does. I couldn't... I couldn't tell. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Let's go back in. There's writing on the wall. I, it just might say something. Alright, I guess it was nothing. Moving on. Wait, there's a jacket. There's always stuff in jackets. Some odds and ends and an old military jacket. Nothing special here. What are you saying, boy? Hey, girl. Come back here. Get back here. Where are you going? Hey! No. Hey! Why did I fall asleep here? It's odd seeing the classroom chair over here. Is it for a school play? Bitch, I got your necklace. Oh. Uh. Is this the necklace? You found 
found it! That's awesome! Thank you! Oh! Well, oh. <laughs> Where did you find it? In the storage room next to the stage. It seems like someone threw it in the vent in there. What? Why would it be in such a place? Well, forget it. You found it anyways. Let's get going before the rain gets heavy. Sure. Oh, wait. Did I just read my part in a gay voice? Is our dude gay now? But he's wanting some of this. I don't think he should be gay. So let's just forget that ever happened. God damn, I keep forgetting. Yeah, my name's Wee, but you can call me Wee Wee. My rapper name's Big Wee Wee. <laughs> wow, it's raining pretty hard. Yes, it is. It's too dangerous to stay here any longer. Let's go. All right. It's the security office by the main gate. I guess even the guard left for home. Here is the campus exit. Okay. What? 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 The bridge collapsed. My voice is so horrible. I'm so sorry. Please excuse me for that. Can we just bring this down a little bit? You gotta be able to see the hand. No freaking way! <laughs> oh, I need to go check this shit out! Oh god! Whoa! Why is the river red? This looks like the apocalypse. It kind of looks like blood! Oh, no shit! Blood. Don't say that! <laughs> what? What do you want me to say? Sorry, I wasn't thinking. What happened? Okay, let's calm down and think about it. There's got to be a reasonable explanation. Hmm. Why is it red? Even muddy water shouldn't be this color. Ah! I think I know the cause of this. There are a few factories located upstream. It's probably them dumping chemical waste into the river under cover of the typhoon. Are you sure? No, we're not sure, bitch. This is just a fucking theory. Theoretical. I've heard people talking about it. Perhaps you're right. The worst part is we don't have a way to go downhill now with the bridge gone. Tons of people cross this bridge every day. This bridge should have been better maintained. I guess we have to head back to school. It won't do us any good standing in the middle of the rain. True. Don't worry, it's just a typhoon. The school has enough supplies for us to get through the storm. Alright. I guess I can trust you. You seem like a reliable person. My voice is fucking up. <laughs> Just trying to be optimistic. <laughs> Let's get going then. All right, girl. You know what we're going to be doing. <laughs> it's going to happen. <sighs> All wet and tired. What a day. Oh, what is she trying to tell us? What is she trying to tell us? I think you know. I know, you know, she knows, but does he know? Just rest up for now. We may have to spend the night here, girl. <laughs> oh, damn, I think he does. Oh, wait. I haven't officially thanked you for finding my necklace for me. Bam! Here it comes, baby. Oh, fuck. It's going to happen right here, right now. You guys seen it first. I'm Fang Ray Shin, a senior from Miss Yen's class. You can call me Ray. 
That's a weird name to call a girl. Are you sure you're even a girl? What's going on? I'm not, I don't know anymore, I don't know. How about you? What grade are you in? So, you are my senior. <laughs> Miss Fang, I'm Wee Chong Ting. <laughs> you got me Wee Wee, Big Wee. You don't have to be formal with me. <laughs> she wants it dirty, boys. It's a bit awkward, just Ray is fine. Normally, we don't go to the senior building. I heard that it's a very competitive environment where everyone works their butt off studying. Ha! It's just that awful. Some of us still do what we want. <laughs> I do interview you for graduating. Soon you won't have to see Gu Fong on a daily basis anymore. Instructor Bay? I don't even dare call him by his whole name. Rumor says he was a relentless killer during the war. I wouldn't dare do that in front of him either. We're all pretty terrified of him. We avoid him any possible way we can. <laughs> hey you, come here. Why are you hiding from me? Are you affiliated with the commies? What is she talking about? Ooh, oh, she was, haha, <laughs> she's doing an impression of the- Whoa! That was a perfect imitation, giving me goosebumps. Ha! <laughs> Anyways, anyway, bitch, you don't need to be graduating just yet. It's anyway. <laughs> just hang in there tight, buddy. It'll be your turn to graduate next year. Ah, life's a struggle. Hey, I know what we can do. Oh, here we go, boys. It's finally the moment. Let me go use that phone in the principal's office, see if I can contact anybody. Then I'll grab the heater in the storage room and a couple of blankets from the health center. We're going to have fun. That's what's going to happen. That should be enough for us to get through the night. Our Wee is a little bit of a fucking genius. He's getting the kerosene heater to make a little romantic light to set the mood. He's getting some covers. It's only going to be one cover. We're going to end up sharing said one cover. That's a well thought out plan. Do you need any help? I'll be fine on my own, little girl. You should rest up here, missus. The man's got it under control. <laughs> Hold on there now. Don't take me as one of those spoiled, pampered girls. I'm probably more capable than most of you boys. Sorry, that came out the wrong way. It's okay. You don't have to apologize. I know you're just trying to help. Okay, how about this? I'll go make the phone call, then we can find what we need together and carry them back. Alright, that sounds good. I'll wait for you right here. Just hurry back. It's getting real dark in here. Bam, boys, we're doing it. We are on the right track. I think we all know where this is headed. Oh, yeah. No need to say it. We all know it. But I'm going to have to end this episode here. Uh, I hope you guys are enjoying this. It's a pretty interesting game. I like it. It really is atmospheric. I feel like I'm a part of this character. Big Wee Wee. That's me. Don't forget it. It can be you too. I don't care. It's all of us. Why not? In the next episode, we will find out if Wee makes it with Ray.